Hello there people, this is Novomage and welcome to a real quick video just to highlight some important information for people who are participating in the Nothing is True tournament. Uh, well, first of all, right now on your screen you should be seeing the bracket layout for the tournament. Essentially the bracket layout was uh, mostly decided by me, although basically what I did is that, is that I just separated some of the known stronger players, well, I mean the ones that I have knowledge of because of course there are a few players that I don't know anything about uh, and I put them like in different brackets so that they meet in the finals but of course we could have surprises but for the most part uh, other than that it was random from the bracket layout as seen on screen each player is, uh, is in one of two lobbies they're either with me Novomage or with Seji Roy. So Seji Roy and I will be the tournament officials. Each player who is in a given lobby should add the person who is the official for their lobby. So for people who are in the lobby with Seji, they should add him as a friend. And for I think I have added already all players in the tournament to my friends list, but in case somebody hasn't, then just the people in my lobby add me to your friends list. All of this is just so that the day of the tournament, then that person will join the party that is hosted by the officer for their lobby. Finally, there's, there's one rule I did not mention in the tournament thread on the Ubisoft forums, and it's a pretty simple rule. No matter what happens in a lobby, no matter how laggy it gets, or no matter <laughs> what kind of weird shenanigans happen during the matches, uh, players should never leave a match. Uh, if you have any complaint about somebody who was lagging in that, hold that thought until the end of the four matches and then because we are recording the tournament, if somebody has any complaint, that person is going to contact the officer for their lobby and we'll evaluate the request and we'll see how much, if anything, it changes in the tournament because if it doesn't change anything at all, then we'll probably just leave it at that. But if it was significant and it would determine whether that person qualifies or not, then we might have to look over the footage that person is going to provide to us from the matches. And we may take a decision based from that. But that's the whole point, like, we're not deciding anything during the matches themselves. Do not stop any match because of any weird thing that happens. The only exception is what I had already said in the Ubisoft forums and is if somebody gets disconnected within the first minute then the officer for that lobby will automatically restart the match from the beginning. But if anybody gets disconnected after the first minute then the match will just continue as normal. The person who will get kicked in the lobby may rejoin the, the lobby and we may consider adding adding the sum you know of both scores before they got kicked and after they got kicked if it makes sense I, s I say if it makes sense because sometimes I mean it's easy to score while you're in a low position and if you get kicked and rejoin then you're probably gonna do more points than you would normally have than if you had stayed but of course I don't think anybody <laughs> is uh, willing to get kicked from the lobby because that will make you lose a lot of time and well that's just terrible <laughs> in general so I don't think nobody's gonna do that intentionally but in any case before doing anything like that we will review the footage of the person who got disconnected to see what happened and how the game turned out also how influential how influential the disconnect was will determine what kind of action we take because if it, if it was not influential influential at all like if, if you were in 8th place and nothing's gonna change then we're probably not gonna do anything about it and that's about it. Uh, best luck to all participants this Sunday for the first Nothing Is True tournament. Yes, here we go, people. All right, see you then.